People, when they come here every year, they love doing it because they never know what to expect. It's not the same every year. You don't know what you're gonna be in for. Beard real, there we go. People are like, you know who you look like? And I tell them, well, who do I look like? And they'll go, Santa. And I say, you got it. Hi, I'm Johnny Rose. I am the creator of Johnny's Hazlitt Holiday Lights Extravaganza, and I love Christmas. I've been doing Christmas lights for about 50 years. My mother started it out as, when I was a kid, about 13. Started teaching me on lights, then how to decorate the tree, decorate some of the outside. She knew that she could always count on me to help her out, but you know, it made us feel better, you know, that we always knew we were there for each other. For my plan, it starts in January. My brother will help me, like he'll come by and ask if I need something. I'm always in awe of my brother's display because this stuff that he comes out with, it's just, it's just amazing to me because I would never think of it. What did Johnny Rose come up with this year? You sit there and I stand there and I'm looking at it and you're trying to picture this, you know, without being up yet. I start with the front of the house. Now in the driveway, I put a 30 to 35 feet of tunnel in there and, it's, and I put all the lights in there and they run to a, like a little computer playing music, so they blink to that. I do a winter wonderland, I put all white lights in there. So I built a shed and, uh, for Santa now. Then I start setting some of the blow-ups in. I'll spend out of my pocket like $3,000. I like to show my way because I know how the lights go up. I know what I'm looking for. Do this the top row first, never do the bottom because what they cross over, they're a pain that separate. It's hard because I like in my mind what I got. And I have to do that way or it's no way. My unique feature, see, I have a, the holy area uh, feature over here. In the holy area feature, I have uh, two angels. Uh, my daughter passed away at thir My daughter was 13, she passed away with cancer at Christmas. Last year, I lost my granddaughter, December 20th. This is the, our way of like communicating to our daughter and granddaughter. The granddaughter, she had a little girl two years old. Now we have to explain to her what happened. I mean, it's hard and she's, kids miss your mother and she misses her. So we told her that the angel is her mother. So she looks at the angel and calls him mom. So this is our way we try to teach kids, you know, you know, different things happen in life, but it's hard, very hard. But that's why it's so special to us, that area. The township here loves the Hazlitt light display. I have the police department, they put the signs up, you know, that the neighbors are very good with it. Uh, they all come over here every night. Their kids walk around, enjoy themselves every night. It's all about kids. It ain't about us. It's about the kids, and we have to be there for the kids. We have a line all the way down around here. They just nonstop, especially the week of Christmas. Santa's out here from like a quarter to six till 11 o'clock at night. In my house here, uh, I never took money from nobody for donations or anything for years. Over the past couple of years, people, what they're doing, they would come and they want to leave some a tip for Santa because of pictures and all that. So I said, no, 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 it's all free. You don't pay for nothing. This is for the kids. They were leaving money in my mailbox, different areas. What, what I do when the people leave the charity money, uh, I'll donate a little bit into the electric and then I take the rest and I donate to different charities at, in the neighborhood. I'm so proud of my brother. And the people, when they come in just to join the, on their faces, and they all think Johnny Rose is the best. I like to do this tradition every year because to me, it means excitement. I think that somebody should always have a house that everybody wants to go to and can get decorations. And I love getting involved with this kind of thing every year. So to me, it's a good tradition and I'll keep that thing going forever.